Good morning everyone from Dollywood. We're here for a very special day. It's Big Bear Mountain Grand Opening. You know, it's been a really long time since we've been here. I know, like a full <laughs> three weeks. <laughs> I, I really was starting to miss it. So we got to see here. Big Bear testing, we got to walk around the plaza, see the station, but now everything's done. We're we actually gonna ride. get to ride it. Yeah. I'm really excited. This like, I don't know, I love Vacoma. Especially like, obviously new Vacoma. Old oh. Vacoma's whatever. <laughs> but this is gonna be great. Like, Wildwood Grove is just Vacoma Grove. This is great. New Vacoma's big jump into U.S. regional theme parks because but prior to this they really only did like Disney stuff and then a bunch of the, old, the older rides. I hope a lot of people come out here and ride this like like park reps and stuff and they're like wow like this is a great option for family coasters. Absolutely and we're going into Wildwood Grove through the backside and we're already getting our first views of the roller coaster. Look at this. Look at all these swooping turns. I know. I'm excited to film this thing. Looks like a bunch of great vantage points. I'm like equally excited to film it as I am to ride it as I've ever had. Uh, no, you're just a nerd. Hunter, you excited to ride? I'm very excited to ride. I was saying, this is like your home park. Like, uh, this is pretty cool. One of the three. One of the three. Tim. I'm so excited. I am a, like a new generation Vacoma fanboy, so I cannot <laughs> wait. No, I really am. I love Guardians, and I love yeah. any Vacoma I've overseas, so I'm really excited for this. I know, yeah. yeah this is great. Cool. I am. <laughs> oh, oh my god. We're all set up for the grand opening that Dolly's doing. Right after she's done, we're all gonna get the opportunity to ride it, and then they're gonna open up to pass holders. So, should be cool. We've been watching the cycle, it looks great. Cool, that's it. Dolly's been talking, all you have to say is it's gonna be cool. I've seen her like three or four times. <laughs> this is like a religious experience. I remember my first time seeing Dolly too. <laughs> Oh my gosh, she's got barriers on. Well, I hear that we're after the big bear uh, with this roller coaster, and I figure if you're trying to catch something, you need some bait, right? And what better than have a girl in a bear suit? What, what's she with doing a, with that pot of honey? Well, that's to catch the bear. <laughs> we're so excited to be here at Wildwood Grove. We got a lot of fun things going on. The big Bear Mountain is a huge coaster taking up almost six acres of property, everyone in the family can ride together. This is going to be a great ride, I think, for everybody on the park. And I'm so excited, everybody says, oh, you're going to ride it. And I said, no, I'm not. I think I'd lose my hair. I think I'd lose my nerve before I even got on it. There's really a legend. All my life, we heard the story about the big bear. It's kind of, I guess everybody has their own version of Bigfoot. So we had the big, you know, the big bear here that everybody was always trying to catch. And he would always, you know, just terrorize everybody. And we thought that a great theme would be for people on the, on the ride to hear the bear coming after you. You can hear him clawing, you can hear him roaring and all that. You can't be here and not sing a song. Oh, I am going to sing a song. In fact, I wrote a song just for this. Big bear. Big Bear Mountain, Big Bear, we're looking for you. Born on a mountaintop in Tennessee, the greenest state in the land of the free. Raised in the woods, he knows every tree. Been terrorizing folks since he was only three. Big Bear, Big Bear Mountain, Big Bear, we're looking for you. Broad as a boulder, tall as a tree, roars like giant feet with you Ned and Benjamin on the case we're gonna expose his hairy face Big Bear Big Bear Mountain Big Bear we're looking for you and I'm gonna pick one everybody Big Bear Big Bear Mountain Big Bear we're looking for you once again now Big Bear Time for our first ever ride on Big Bear Mountain. Hey, but Dolly's that way. <laughs> yeah, do, yeah, Dolly's uh, Dolly's leaving. <laughs> no. Here's our first look at the queue. At least that first building. You can see the bear. 
all the different signs. I mean, look at how big the bears. It, it's it's, like it's pretty gold. pretty big, you know. Do you think that's the scale? Uh, yeah, exactly. And then here's all the different sightings. We're walking under this section of track right here. See a bunch of the Ooh. equipment over there. There's some honey. All right, after a considerable delay, we're finally about to ride. I think it'll be worth the wait. Oh, I, I am very happy yeah. to ride this. Yeah, it went down for a little bit. They had to do an evac, which I mean happens when it's a brand new roller coaster. But we're finally about to go. Back row. First ever rides on Big Bear Mountain. We got three rides towards the back and then up front, and that was a lot of fun. Really, really long. It is a, I know, really like, long. I'm like, yeah. when you hit like the, the third launch, I'm like, oh my god, I'm still going. Yeah, <laughs> like most roller coasters, I feel like would have ended at that point. It's like yep. a two for one deal. It's I know. So much fun. It and really is. In the back spaghetti bowl section, like, it's just like winding all over, and it pulls some pretty solid forces, too. It does, very solid forces. Like, after a couple rides, I'm a little dizzy, actually. Yeah. <laughs> What do you think, Tim? Oh my god, it was so much fun. <laughs> it really is. Like, you loved it's, it. It's so long, it's like a perfect length. Yeah, it's it's right incredibly smooth. Like, very, yeah. very the, smooth. It's definitely the smoothest yeah. ride in this park by far. Yes. Bar. And I love the onboard audio. And then you go through the little tunnel with the water. Like, yeah. I got a little spray, like it's really nice. The bear jokes, though. The bear jokes, bear there jokes. are so unbearable. Puns. So many bear puns. I barely heard any puns. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, bear right, no, bear left. I wonder who bared the responsibility of coming up with all those puns. But you know what? They need some trees. Right now it's barren. It is barren. The puns were very good. I give this right a B for bear. <laughs> Sure enough, we're back for more rides. And there's literally no one here now. Like, it was so full right after Dolly came out, and I guess everyone left. And they haven't opened up for passengers yet, so they were just sending out trains that had like two people on them. What? Big Bear Mountain, we went to the back for that one. Uh, the pacing of that ride is really fun. Like, it's just very consistent. Yeah. It know, almost keeps the same speed, like, the whole time, or at least it feels that way. I'm starting to get a little pissed, though. Four rides in, and I still have not found this damn bear. No. They're like, like, maybe you'll find him next time. They're like, was that Big Bear? Uh, no way to know, know for sure. I don't know about that. It's funny, because you go into the waterfall, and they're like, there he is. And I'm like, where? Where, <laughs> where is this bear? She is so excited to meet Big Bear. But you were right here all along. So now you don't need to ride the ride because you can just come Wait. find the bear right here. Wait, are you looking for Big Bear? We're looking for Big Bear. Oh, he is a Big Bear. That's a Big Bear? That's not the Big Bear? This is not the Big Bear. This is average size bear. This is Benjamin Bear. Oh! Benjamin says it's very nice to meet you. We'd love to meet you. See, very now, nice to meet you too. With the tales that we've heard, we've heard that Big Bear could be as big as that rock rock there. You see that big thing? That's a big rock. Yeah, that was. You're not that big. He's a big. That's bear. bigger than the rock. We, we've been on the lookout for Big Bear for a hot minute. You see, we've been looking for him, and our friend Ned he paved that big trail up there so people could get a good vantage point. Did you guys get to ride that ride? Yeah, we 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 rode the trail. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that's wonderful. Well, now y'all tell everybody get as many people as you can to keep an eye out, okay? And y'all keep looking too. We're looking. Y'all keep an eye out, okay? We'll keep. We're, so we're hey, and can you do me a favor? Like, you speak bear, so like, if you see him, like, tell him we're looking for him, okay? Can you do that? Thank you. Appreciate it. We saw this area when we were here a couple weeks ago, but now that the water is turned on, it's just very impressive looking. Uh, fantastic detail. I, I kind of wish that there was more of this around the roller coaster. It's really just this one spot. I remember when Wild 
Ottawa Grove first opened, seeing this area, you know, saying it's really nice, but it just needed a little something. So now you have Coaster Track in the background. It just works. It looks a lot better. I feel like it helps bring this area together, even with this uh, bear ride. Not the big bear, just a little bear. You can still see the roller coaster just like sprawling all around this area. So at this point in time, Big Bear Mountain is open to the public. And actually, for an opening day, this wait time is pretty good. We're only looking at 35 minutes, which may be the longest wait in the park, but it's still not that bad considering that Lightning Ride is currently at 30 minutes. Granted, that is on one train, but still, Big Bear Mountain for being brand new, pretty good. You can see they have a bit of an extended queue set up right here next to one of the main queue buildings. All right, so the coaster's going up and over your heads, directly over top of the pathways. Makes for some great visuals. Here's our up close look at the entrance sign, which is actually a pretty interesting design that they went through, actually putting the name uh, small up here while you see the bear up front. But what it does make for is a really good photo op. Look, they even have bear paws right here. So if you stand on those, then you get a pretty cool shot right there. So I like it. And then your actual entrance is just right over here, which if you look right now, it's a full queue. So the fact that that's only 35 minutes when it's also filled over there is pretty impressive. Look who found a safari hat. Where did you get that? Tanner Tucker. Tanner Tucker. Where he got it from remains to be seen. Where is, but I like where is Tanner Tucker? They're all in line. They're in line? What? So with that wait listed at 35 minutes, let's see if it actually ends up being accurate. I don't know, I, I'm very curious. It looks like the line is moving very fast, so time to see for ourselves. Big bear search today. Love all these details. We heart bears. Is big bear real? I saw the bear. He was easily 20 feet tall. That looks like something I would draw. So I know that some of the team members have Easter eggs in this queue with like their names listed on here. I don't know how many of these are real or actual people, but at least in some of these areas there are Easter eggs from people who have work on this ride. Alright, let's see what Ned Oakley's reading. Yep, you guessed it, it's about bears. Lots of different maps and trails too. And more diagrams. <laughs> Ah, Dollywood, always teaching us something too. Here's what to do in case of a bear attack. But they do not tell you about the anti-sea bear circle you're supposed to draw on the ground. Did you bring your anti-sea rhinoceros underwear though? I did not. I came prepared for the sea bear, but not Wait, the sea rhinoceros. I can wear my hat in a goofy fashion. Like this? No, actually like this. So if you pay attention when it launches out on this first section, it literally sounds like the Hagrid bikes going around the course. Like Weird. onboard audio, both themed to like going out into the woods basically. Except this one you're looking for a bear which is very much not a magical creature. Well, the bear might be a magical creature. We don't know. We haven't found it to verify. Still looking. After five rides, we still wouldn't have found the stupid bear. I guess we'll have to come back to Dollywood. Sneaky little bastard. Our last ride is going to be in the front row, which is the best row. Yay. I think we've definitely established this is a front row ride. So there we are, our last rides of the night there. Big Bear Mountain, so that brings our ride count to five, which is pretty good for an opening day. Oh, sorry okay. guys, I got six. Oh! Maybe seven. Wait, when did you do that? When you were filming. Oh uh, yeah, that's natural. Yeah, it happens. fun! Anyways, it's fun, it's a good time, super long experience. For a family guy. Yes, it's gonna do really well with this audience. Like, they get so many families that roll on through in here. And like with such a low height requirement, it like introduces them to forces that they will experience on bigger rides. So like, you know, you start to feel some positives and like on the uh, points where there would be like crazy airtime on like other hills, this is just like, you don't quite come up out of your seat, but it's like, it's like, you know, a taste it's of a what airtime is. It's yeah. A so, it's not airtime. Yeah. It, it's good. Oh my gosh, it's Tanner Tucker. Oh.
What do you think? It was fun. Yeah? I like it. It's a really good family coaster. Yeah? Yeah. That's it? Yeah. Come out here at Dollywood. Bring your kids if you have them. I'm sure they'll love this roller coaster. And if you don't, bring yourself. <laughs> but hope you enjoyed this one. And of course, make sure to stay tuned for more here at Coaster Studios. We'll see you next time.